what's up youtubes welcome back to my channel juggernaut lifestyle about yesterday's video to all of you guys that viewed my video to all of you people that commented all of you people that liked the video i thank you once again for the support from now on as you know we're going to have this vlogging style of videos where i give you my opinion on certain topics that are trending certain topics that people might not be comfortable talking about um today's video we are going to talk about the liver king and yes i say it like this the liver king he's a guy that's been exploding all over social media to be honest what do i think of the liver king i honestly believe the guy is a fraud i think that everything he preaches you have to really take it with a grain of salt. Um, there are some things that he talks about which make sense, like working out, trying to eat healthy, uh, trying to keep your body fat levels low, trying to keep active, trying to make time for family. There's a lot of good things that he talks about, which I feel we can take and we can incorporate into our daily lives. On the other side, there's a lot of things he talks about which makes no sense. Like, number one, he doesn't talk about the fact that the guy looks juiced to the gills. He looks like he's either on some sort of Trenbolone, Diana Ball, one of those um, PEDs, you know, one of those steroids. There is no way that it is humanly possible to look the way that the liver king looks without taking something to boost your natural testosterone levels. As human beings, as men, we were not built that way. Yes, you might get the one in a hundred kind of guy that has superb genetics. He literally has better genetics than the rest of maybe the other 99 guys he might come across in his life. But unfortunately, the liver king is not natural. This is where he's actually portraying a false sense of hope for people. The next problem I have with the liver king is the fact that he is selling a brand. If you watch him over social media, you'll realize that at the end of every video, at the end of every Instagram post, the liver king promotes ancestral living. What is ancestral living? Ancestral living is the supplement brand that the liver king is a business partner in. So he actually looks the part to sell you a product. He eats raw eggs. He eats raw bone marrow. He eats liver raw every day. And yes, there is some scientific proof that tells you that eating raw liver, rich in a lot of vitamins which your body needs, eating raw eggs, rich in a lot of vitamins which your body needs, but unfortunately, we as human beings have evolved into the people that have fire <laughs> so unfortunately the liver king um he does have a message which you can benefit from but i feel in a nutshell i feel that the liver king is a fraudster he's a fraud whichever term you want to call him he's somebody that's exploding all over social media just because of this advice where I feel as people after the whole, um, you know, sense of 2020 and, you know, the, the pandemic, um, I feel that we as people, we sense, we, we simply hold on to things which give us a sense of hope that, you know what, this is going to make me healthier. This is going to make me stronger. This is going to make me live longer, right? We all have that sense of hope where we hold on to things. Um, and that's not our fault. It's our human instinct to constantly want to better ourselves. So he's a guy that's capitalizing on, I would say, the weakness that we have in most of our societies, most of our environments. We have the weakness of, you know, um, they call it the rise of the weak man, where people have become more fragile. People tend to get sicker faster. There's more germs out there, more bacteria out there. So we think that clinging onto something which was our history, our past. Remember, we as human beings, we evolved from the people that ate raw meat, the hunter-gatherers. We evolved into people that created fire. We started cooking our food. 
science has proved in the last hundred years that cooking your food is beneficial to you, right? There's certain kinds of bacteria that we kill when we cook the meat. So basically, my opinion is that the liver king, any advice he gives you regarding diet, regarding exercise as well, you need to take it with a grain of salt because number one, the guy's diet is ridiculous, right? In the sense where I'm sure that works for him, but it doesn't guarantee that it's going to work for everyone. Number two, the guy is definitely using some sort of PED, some sort of performance enhancing drugs. My honest opinion, the guy is taking Trinbolone sandwiches. For you guys in the fitness industry, you know what I mean. I personally, I am a natural athlete. So me looking at a guy portraying this kind of false information and giving people false hope, I think that, to be honest, eventually people will discover that, you know what, eating raw liver, raw eggs, raw testicles every day is going to be... Um, not that beneficial in the long term and then also genetics play a part he's selling you a false sense of hope that if you follow his diet if you buy his supplements and stick to his training plan religiously that you will look like him that's nearly impossible the guy has really good abdomen um, insertions so his abdomen looks really developed he's got a really thick six-pack um, the guy is easily between 10 and 15% body fat year round. Um, there's a lot of things where I'm not hating on the guy, but I just feel that a lot of people out there need to realize that the liver king is selling you a dream which is unrealistic. It's not even realistic in a dream, to be honest. Um, so there's a lot of things about him that I personally feel is basically fraudulent. There's a lot of things about him that is fake. This is just my opinion. Um, once again, to all you guys that have subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. And to all of you guys that like my videos and watch my videos, if you'd like me to make a video where I talk about anything else, any particular topic, any particular fitness influencer, anything in general, just leave your comment in the comment section and I'll consider making a video about it. Goodbye, enjoy the rest of your day.